day, we attempt to win the Super Bowl with all 32 NFL teams. By the end of this video, yes, your favorite team will reach the pinnacle of the NFL, but of course, there is a twist, and as there always is, I have a chance to lose a lot of money. Winning a full game with all 32 NFL teams would take a long time, and I would rather not take like two weeks recording one video. So for each Super Bowl matchup today, I'm allowed to simulate as long as I want to and whenever I want to within the game. I can simulate at the beginning, I can simulate at the end, I can simulate the entire thing if I'm confident the team winning, but it could set me up for failure. For each game that we lose today, I have to put $50 towards a grand total pot, which will represent the amount of money I will give away to you guys in the comment section below. If you want to enter the giveaway in the comment section below, you have to vote for your play of the video. I have no clue what to expect. I could lose 15 games, I could lose one, I could lose 100. Rather not lose 100, that's a lot of money. And our opponent in each Super Bowl matchup is going to be whichever team represented the conference that we're not in. For example, when we use the Browns and win the Super Bowl with the Browns, we have to go up against the Rams. I thought that was just a neat concept to maybe save me some time and sanity playing this game and also, you know, up the suspense a little bit. Get you guys involved, maybe win yourself some money. And yes, for those of you wondering, it will be played on all Madden, so this is gonna be tough. But for all I know, I have no idea how many games I'm actually gonna have to play. For each matchup today, we're gonna have the same game settings, arcade game style, because at the end of the day, yeah, I know simulation and competitive are more realistic, but like, we're here for fun, dude. I don't think I'm a good Madden player. Why pretend? Make it four minute quarters. That actually could end up hurting me but if i have to spend a couple hundred dollars to eventually save myself like 10 days of playing madden dude i will freaking take it matchup number one let's see if justin fields can win a super bowl before joe burrow maybe i should super sim the defense to begin and hopefully we can get some sort of three and outs i really don't want to go down to like start this video and it looks like you know, the Bengals are going to probably come out score first drive going to only allow a field goal and of course it's evan dude he's a freaking demon but i'm gonna try for the big plays aligned to Day just to try to score as fast as possible because we have 31 more teams to go through and and that's not optimal that probably should have cleared this up in the intro as well we have to win the super bowl with each team so how many total games it actually takes me that's gonna determine how much money i have to spend just gonna continue to blitz the entire city of zimbabwe on this play because we're gonna get to joe burrow in the end zone and we are going to get our first two points of the video this looks like a freaking baseball score in the ninth inning robinson i, I beg you dude i mean this is pa crossers it's got to work off the tip we practiced that we practiced that let's go a rock Come on, bro. I just want to get this first game over with. Oh my god, that's going to be a dot. That is going to be a touchdown. I, I really thought he caught it. I think he's going to have enough speed to break the edge. Justin Field into the end zone as finally some breathing room. If we can find a way to go 99 yards here and score a touchdown, which could be on this play, Tariq Cohen, there's no way. Get, who is that? They always come out of nowhere. You know what? I'm just gonna chunk this deep. This is this is arcade mode for a reason, and he's gonna go up and he's gonna come down. He's gonna make the catch. Thor, now Mooney, I love you. If we keep simulating this bad boy, we're up 20 to 3. Game number one, matchup number one. We actually come out of it not having to give away our first $50. Justin can't believe it. I can't. So much positivity in Chicago right now. Matt Nagy's gone, and now they actually have themselves the Super Bowl trophy. Well, this is already weird. We're gonna have a rematch of the Super Bowl. This is the time where the Bengals can make things right, get that revenge, and win themselves their first ever Lombardi trophy. Come on, Joe. You're gonna annoy me today. At least have a good game for me. Well, try to see how far we can get simming in, uh, play number one, 22 yards. Yes, run, though. Is that too risky? Now we're doing it. Risk it for the biscuit. Risk it for the bingo, and I, I risked it wrongly. That was extremely anticlimactic. If nothing's open, bro, I'm just still this ball deep to Jamar Chase, and I'm just gonna throw this ball deep to Jamar Chase, and Jalen Ramsey's there. I'm nervous he's gonna go up. He's gonna make the kid. He's a demon. Jamar Chase have my babies. Bro, he literally just did that on top of Jalen Ramsey. I mean, that's realistic. Okay, Jamar Chase is about to be so open, and he's gonna be able to catch and run as he breaks the tackle. Jamar Chase, bro, this guy is an absolute freaking monster. Oh my god, we finally gotta stop. We're getting this ball back, and let's take this lead boys play action pass i think 
This deep route is uh, he I I I that's me. I did that. I made that horrible throw. No, 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 no. That was supposed to go so different and it and it went so badly. Oh please, I don't want to be like forced into going for this. I think he's gonna make the catch. He got the first down and more. Joe Mixon keep oh my god, I love Madden. Best game ever! Best game ever! Joe Mixon's a psycho! Oh, I didn't even realize, bro, it's third and goal! Oh, thank God, dude. Oh, I blitzed everybody, and they're gonna have so many people open. He fumbled the ball again! He fumbled the ball again! Let's go! One with the ball! Boys, sometimes you just rather be lucky than good. How fitting would this be to come down to an Evan McPherson field goal? I, I think that's just got to be the case at this point. What are the odds I actually miss this? Like, if anybody would somehow find a way to miss this, it'd be me. And I, I really hope in this case it's not me. Kick is up. Evan McPherson. In this instance, you made me happy. There you have it, Bengals fans. The Lombardi Trophy. And I thank you for not making me spend 50 bucks. Bills and Rams. And this is where I feel like you can actually put potentially be able to save some time because maybe in a sim the bills can win from start to finish hey, we're going backwards regardless what is happening what is actually going on in this dumb freaking game we got ourselves an interception what like just come on keep on moving in the field we take the lead come on defense one more stop i'm just gonna click the button i'm gonna click the button i'm just gonna look up top it and we still saw how do we have the lead still we are up 14-3 i might actually be able to get myself through our third out of 32 games and the LA Rams are gonna go down the field not scoring boys your Buffalo Bills finally are going to uh, this game will never end it feels like there had to be more possessions in that game from either team than like a 15 minute long game now Denver Broncos versus the Cincinnati Bengals I accidentally jumped into the game as the Bengals I just got confused I already told you guys the warning at the beginning I'm a moron starting off the second half I would be so freaking happy if we can find a way to score a touchdown it's fourth and one like this is where I'm gonna jump in I'm gonna override what the CPU is gonna do and I'm gonna run the football every Melvin I've ever met that has done me wrong always gave him a second chance and they've always shown out Let's just make sure we actually score here we're gonna score we scored but get the ball back boys that might be enough and that's gonna be enough unless something catastrophic happens here your Denver Broncos end up being much easier to win the Super Bowl with than the first two teams what a Super Bowl this would be Brown Browns Rams. Browns fans, I'm gonna bring you your first Super Bowl, but please make this easy on me. I simmed one play. And to be honest, I didn't even mean to click the A button. How am I gonna work my way out of this one? Okay, that's just kind of odd like I, I i know that that does seem sketchy but to be completely honest and all the sketchiness i really don't care because i'm so happy i'm giving baker one final that's just too funny. Like, who coded this game? Steven Spielberg? Winning this with Case Keenum as our starting quarterback. Come on, Nicholas. Break his ankles. Break his collarbone. Break his sternum. I mean, honestly, about five minutes ago, I thought we were going to lose this game by over 21 points. So I'll take where we're at right now. What do I do in this situation? Like, somebody screenshot. Tell me what to do. We've got to get to the end zone. Like, there's just no other scenario here. We're just going to run it in. Case Keenum with some secret little mysterious wheels of his. I mean, our defense is playing out of their minds right now. And then they pick up 21 yards to... <laughs> That's just so ironic. That is so ironic. But are they gonna go for this? They're gonna go for this, and I'm nervous. That makes me nervous. And they ran it up the middle. We got the stop, and we got a fumble! Why are we causing so many fumbles? Oh, Austin Hooper's wide open. Who the heck is supposed to be covering him? Oh my god! Jalen Ramsey's burnt! Oh my god! Austin Hooper? Where did that come from? That is the play of the video up to this point. Your Cleveland Browns finally win themselves a Super Bowl. Baker got benched after like five pass attempts because all five were friggin' interceptions. Hold on, does that mean Case Keenum's gonna be the one he gets the hug? You got Case Keenum on your Browns holding a Lombardi trophy. You got to be thankful. Now we have the chance to win one final Super Bowl with Tom Brady. And bro, I didn't realize the Buccaneers got up by 92 overall. Hopefully that means we'll see a lot of simming. They're gonna score. Of course they are. Something's telling me we're gonna be able to fly right through this one because we're gonna get a three now. Let's go, dude. 14-0. It's 21-0. Let's just go ahead, back out, jump for 
the end of the game because we already know it's 35-3. 45-16 is what Tom Brady finishes off his career with. There it is. Beautiful magic. The GOAT. Let's me just click a button and get a dub. I've been sat here for over two hours now and we're just now making it out of the bees. Oh, of course DeAndre Hopkins is going to make that catch, dude. It's DeAndre. Like we always say, do the smart thing. We're in the same exact play, but to the opposite side. Nobody can say you ran the same play twice in a row. I mean, he's so open. He can catch this in stride. We didn't lead him quite enough, but is that AJ Green? The guy was a menace this year. An absolute demon. Matt Prater, if Evan can make it, you can make it. And he does. At least we go into halftime without a deficit. Oh no, they're just like, they're just going so fast. They're already at the freaking goal line. And they are going to kick a field goal. They're going to tie it up, but it could honestly be so much worse. We're gonna... Oh, that's just not good, is it? Honestly, last time I called fumble, it happened. So I'm calling fumble. I am not a fan of Jamar Chase. Not at all. That's the block on the outside. Can we get the edge? Oh, he has the speed. Oh, Kyler, I beg. Do we risk the, we're gonna risk the fumble? What is this play? When is this like when did that get put in Madden? I mean, it's cool. Like, do I really go for two? Like, do I trust myself? This is actually a pretty wild call right here. Two point conversion, two minutes, 35 left to go. And James Conner is the most beautiful human being on this earth. Like, what was that? Extremely grateful that you're a cardinal. I don't know if this is the best way to go about this, but I'm here. We're going to try it. I got a man cover this guy. Everybody's so open. Everybody's so open. Just let him score. Let him score. That's the best thing to do. Just let him freaking score. CJ in the end zone. This is scary. This is so scary. I swear to everything. I swear to everything. I didn't mean to press A. This is actually... Unbelievable. So now they can kick a field goal. They'll be up by eight. This might be it, dudes. This might be my 50 freaking dollars just done for. Oh, it's such a big hit. They might actually be getting knocked out of field goal range. I am guessing running. They very well could pass this. They didn't pass it. I missed the big hit. They might actually be able to kick this field goal. I am so scared. Evan McPherson, you've already ruined my life once, bro. Just for once, like sneeze. Like, got, like sneeze halfway through. Oh, block. I I did a... Calm down. I was honestly beginning to believe he was an alien. I had never witnessed that guy once in my life miss a field goal until now. We're okay. We don't have to worry about aliens. All we need is a touchdown. Just gotta get into the end zone one way or another. Please don't intercept this. Kyler, we gotta have a talk. I beg you, bro. Just, just give me a first down. DeAndre Hopkins is absolutely clamped. I see you coming over the middle. Oh my god, that's clutch, but we're, we're barely gonna have any time. This is about to be $50 down the drain, isn't it? We have 14 seconds. This is just gonna go to the end zone. I'm just chunking this ball to the end zone. We're gonna reset after this play. Watch him catch it. He caught it. Oh my god. I am seriously proposing to you a marriage. That was a $50 catch. How am I gonna take this? How is my heart gonna be able to take the rest of these games? Next, we have the Battle of Los Angeles. The Rams, Chargers. We should be able to stand our own. We're only like four overall less than the Rams. If anybody's gonna score in this simulation, it's gonna be this offense. I mean, you have Justin Herbert, Keenan Allen, Mike Williams. I think that blue line's a good thing. Mike Williams, who we just mentioned, big 14-yard catch. Give me a second. I think there should be enough space. Mike Williams with the reception. Pay that man his money. This might be an easy W. Bearing something absolutely astronomical in the second half. The LA Chargers have proven to be the kings of Los Angeles. 33-21. Chargers get the dub. And that ended up being a lot easier than what I expected. I think it's just so important to get that early touchdown. This should hopefully be the easiest dub of the entire video. Hopefully I can just simulate the entire thing. I literally have so much confidence in the Chiefs that I'm just going to begin by jumping to uh, the end of the game. I can jump out if I need to. We have a two possession lead. Come on, just be one easy dub. Don't let them score. Don't stress me out. Oh god, they got the ball back. Okay, okay. You see what I'm saying? That could have been bad, but that's $50 I get to save just from clicking a button and watching two teams simulate. Thank god his brother isn't up there with him though. Another matchup against the Rams. This one will be a little bit more difficult Colt because we have Carson Wentz as our starting quarterback. Let's see if at least the Colts defense can come out and make a big stop defensively to start off this game. So our defense is going to have to carry us. We're going to sim and we're, we're already down. We, we got to we gotta, we gotta jump out. Like this has got to be an interception of some sort. Like that's just not real. Don't trust Carson Wentz at all. So we're trying another screen pass here to Jonathan Taylor. But like Aaron Donald's all over him. 
He's gonna make a man miss. We have so many blocks down the field. A little spin move action. Another little spin move action. And I'll take that. Definitely need to get this ball out of our hands quickly. T.Y. Hilton, the veteran. It's a touchdown. The only way you can score a touchdown with Carson Wentz is when a little bit of luck's involved. If we can just wait for this deep post to develop. Oh my god, please. Please drop it in the bucket. Let's go! That's Zach Pascal, a pretty underrated Colt, I must say, even as a Titans fan. But right this second, I'm a Zach Pascal fan. You know what? For the memes, I'm just going to go for this and go for the lead. We have Jonathan Taylor at running back, dude. Like, what do you mean? We're going to pick this up. I mean, I know they have Aaron Donald, but come on, dude. It's Jonathan Taylor. Colts have the lead. Oh, no. Now he's got a freaking glowing X underneath his body. That can only be positive, I suppose. Just run the ball like we have all drive long. And just like that, down to the five-yard line, and there comes the timeout. Like, do I score? I didn't mean to. I really didn't. Watch him win now on a last-second field goal. There's just no way. What are you even trying to do, Matthew? Sit down. Game over. And as much as it pains me to say the Indianapolis Colts are Super Bowl champions, 23-17 over the Rams. Now, that one was a sweaty. It hurts so bad. This is just one of the most unusual sights of all time. We have the Cowboys. They're a 90 overall. So in a simulation against the Bengals, we might actually have a shot for an easy one. Come on, Dak Prescott. Let's prove that you're an all-time Cowboy great. We start the game off with a good drive. Our defense sucks, though. Our offense is very good. Let's go ahead and sim one more quarter. We got to stop it, boys. This one might actually be pretty simple. Maybe not. Our defense sucks. Our defense sucks. Our defense is really bad, but our offense is good. 28-21. Like, do I just go ahead and jump in here? They tied the game. They're about to take what? Like, what is going on? Like, there's just so much I just had to witness, and I'm about to be $50 down the drain thanks to the freaking Cowboys defense. Joe Mixon literally just ran over the entire defense. We are now down by seven in the fourth quarter. He blocked the extra point. Take that one, Evan. Oh, my God. We can actually go down and win on a walk-off extra point. Let's do this thing. Let's get this bread, brother. That should be another first down. CeeDee Lamb. This should keep the clock moving. They're not going to call the timeouts just yet. Low, methodical, and hopefully not expensive. So we have to focus on scoring ourselves here. Let's just like, let's just be calm, collected in the end zone. We're going to leave the Cincinnati Bengals 11 seconds. And there's just no way, right? There's no way. Wait, can you be ice at an extra point? There's no way that's real. Oh, well, we're like lined up, I think, right down the middle, dude. I mean, that's just got to be perfect, right? It's just an extra point. Oh, that was almost perfect down the middle. I was a little scared for a second to come out with another slim one-point victory as your Dallas Cowboys stressful game again in their drought and win themselves a Super Bowl 35-34. to Dak Prescott has what it takes to actually get this done in real life. Now, this one might end up being rather tough. The 78-rated Miami Dolphins led by Tua versus the 89-rated Rams. Really want to save my money. Giving you one. One quarter, Miami. One quarter. I mean, the defense is looking good. We actually have the lead. Okay. A 6 nothing lead is better than what I expected, but then they just can't kick field goals and expect to win Super Bowls. They've kicked three field goals. Like, how does that even happen? One of these routes has got to get open. Oh, my God. It might actually be. Oh, my God. I think he actually threw that on an absolute dime. Tua! Where did that come from, bro? Get the ball back. Are we actually going to win this? The Miami Dolphins, I believe, are going to come out on top. We get the dub. 24 17 the miami dolphins like 10 overall underdogs end up being one of our easiest wins of the entire video like what i do play one or two drives oh there's the hug almost forgot gotta show the majestic hug Ooh, the bingles and eagles i could really see this one going either way but at least we're holding our own we're not gonna go on top we're actually gonna go in the halftime down by we tied it up i mean honestly i can't ask for much better from a team like six overall lower concentration i think they're gonna have this clamp maybe we can fit that in there and let's go a laser that was actually Jalen Rager on the reception I'm pretty sure if you would have made a play like this in real life Eagles fans would have forgiven him for everything bringing the entire city of Tahiti on this play third and one we're gonna stop Joe Burrow in the backfield we got him clamped and it's a fumble a strip sack we're gonna recover and we are taking over at the 23 yard line another chance to win a Super Bowl on a last second field goal probably should have chewed more but like I believe in our defense to get a stop and 
why is that the situation where we end up breaking three tackles on one play? Like, why can't you just go down, Miles? To prove I have faith in my defense, I'm just gonna go for two. The Bengals will have to go out in the field, score a touchdown, and go for two all in a minute and 30 seconds. It'll read option action. We have Jalen Hurts at quarterback. So easy. Just no way, right? We're just gonna simulate this game, and I, I don't know. What, what, what was that? How was I supposed to know what just happened? Did they score? They scored a touchdown there, and I didn't even get my play call in, so they're going for two. They're going to tie the game, so this is a pretty big play. I would rather get the stop. They ran the ball. We're gonna be right there. Oh my god. Unhealthy blood pressure levels. They've peaked. The Philadelphia Eagles, for the first time since you saw Nick Foles win it, have won the big game. 25 to 23. Jalen Hurts is now a Super Bowl champion. Getting close and personal with Joseph now is Jalen. Oh god, let's at least be up by 26 points at halftime. Come on, Arthur Smith. Come on, Falcons. Let's get off to a fast start. And we're down 3 nothing already. And of course, we didn't score. But now we are on top. 7-3. Oh, I thought it was about to be a two-minute warning. <laughs> Wait, is that Sam Hubbard? Hold the phone. Isn't he a defensive player? I might actually try to hit Kyle Pitts on the drag because he's just so fast. And he's going to break tackles like that and run over folks and stiff on folks for the first down. A coming over the middle. That's a touchdown. Kyle Pitts. Who else? Trusted my defense for a drive, and you see where that gets me. There's just so many fumbles. I might need to turn fumbling down because it seems like in arcade mode, every time you hit stick, you get a fumble. Right now, I'm not complaining because I think that might have easily just confirmed that I saved myself 50 bucks, but I will visit that after this game. Oh no, he's open too, isn't he? That's just not what you like to see. Oh my god, Tajay Sharp. Tajay Sharp to win the game with the catch. Just get down. Get down. Don't fumble or just get into the end zone. Just just get into the end zone. It was doctor's orders, Tajay. There's 20 seconds. I mean, it is Jamar Chase. It is the Bengals. We get the ball back and we are going to bring a Super Bowl championship to Atlanta. Matt Ryan can't even believe it. You get the World Series trophy. You win the college football playoff. Now you win yourself a Super Bowl. In this instance, though, I feel so bad for Julio. The Commanders this could be tricky, but I do want to take up the challenge of finally giving Ryan Fitzpatrick a Super Bowl ring. Man deserves it. I think this will be the theme for the rest of the video. We'll sim the first quarter of every game and see where we're at, and we're not where we want to be. I really thought we were about to go down 14-0, and I think it's a miracle that we're not. Come on, football team or commanders, whatever your name is now. You're supposed to be simpler to win the Super Bowl with than the Dolphins, at least. Oh, I did not mean the blitz. I'm so dumb. Joe's gonna find somebody. No, he's not. He's gonna be knocked in a field goal range. A huge play by the youngster Montez Sweat. Wait, why is the right trigger button so big? Guys, this is that new play that I found in the playbook. It's called PA Crossers first down. Oh, Curtis Samuel. That release wide open touchdown football team commanders, whatever your name is. Wait, why am I going for two? Like, I just did this without even thinking. So maybe that's nature telling me I need to do so. Maybe I need to stop listening to nature. Oh my god, let's go! JD McKissick on what was probably a 30 five yard dump off oh my god i feel like just two seconds ago we were down by seven about to go down by 14 it felt like look up the word majestic it has ryan fitzpatrick right next to it in the dictionary let's go football team on top by two possessions you know from here i'm totally gonna trust the commanders they have ryan fitzpatrick as their starting quarterback they gave him a touchdown immediately this is not good at all folks this is not good at all we just took a lead and we're actually gonna get the dub oh my god they got scary for a second we had some majestic drive there at the end of the game and yes one of the worst if not the worst reign franchise in all of the nfl has won themselves a championship one way or another ryan Fitzpatrick, he's the one I wanted to get the ring for. Mr. Majestic himself. With all the crap that this franchise's fans have had to go through the last few years, they at least deserve this few minutes of euphoria. That does not look like Ryan Fitzpatrick at all. 49ers lost last time they tried in real life, but today in Madden, can we finally come out with the dub? Hopefully so, where that means I have to give away 50 bucks. 3 nothing lead, 3-3? Three, three? Come on, bro, we're the San Francisco 49ers. We live and die by the run. Little toss sweep. Oh my god, that could be a touchdown.
that's not the way I thought it was going to end up being a touchdown, or at least close to it, but I'll take that. You can punch it in three yards, right? 10-3, to three, and of course, we're going to go down the field in two seconds, but at least we head on to a field goal, and we get a touchdown, and just, like, so much happens. I don't have time to say a sentence without something big happening. Oh my god, it's going to be a fourth down and one. What are they going to do? They're going to go for it, right? Oh my god, they're going for it. This could be the game right here, boys. I'm going to guess run up the middle. This Super Bowl pretty much all comes down to this. Up the middle. Joe Mixon's going nowhere. One of the few times that guess from the middle actually works. 49ers, it maybe took you a few years. Maybe you thought against the Chiefs you were going to get it done, but you just had to wait a few years for that team to blossom. But to be honest, that win, I felt like, should have been easier. Oh, well, no matter what your team's overall is, winning the Super Bowl with Jimmy G should be considered a pretty impressive feat. I have to beat the Bengals with the Giants, dude. Why do I feel like by the time we sim through the first quarter, it's already going to be like 21 to nothing? How are we supposed to do this with Daniel Jones? Danny Dimes, let's go. Hold on, there's just no way, right? We're about to go on top by two touchdowns, and we actually do. What is happening? We're just going to go ahead and simulate the halftime. How are the Giants winning by 14? It's no longer by 14. They're probably going to tie it before halftime. Oh, my God. If we can actually get out of here with a sim game with the Giants, I will apologize to every Giants fan and get a tattoo of you in my armpit. Just like, don't start the half with a touchdown. They're about to take the lead. I just don't feel like they run the ball in the middle three straight plays, but part of me wants to click guess run up the middle one final time. It's going to be the right we should have done it we should have done it evan ingram though i think he's gonna be able to make this catch and he's gonna be able to run for a few extra under a minute left to go saquon with so much space let's just oh i kind of wish i stayed in bounds make sure we don't score get down at like the one don't break the tackle or just, or just break it just do the exact opposite of what i said oh evan just get out of my life for once just leave i almost decided to blitz the entire team but we eventually backed off, and it's, I think, a decent decision. One final stop. The Giants are Super Bowl champions. Joseph's moving in the pocket, and where was the man who was supposed to cover T? Oh, uh, that's horrible. They're kicking the field goal. Are you serious? They're kicking the field goal and taking this thing into overtime. Oh, my God. This would be the perfect opportunity for a block. Oh, well, we don't get it. This coin toss could be worth 50 bucks. The Bengals, of course, they've won the toss. That's unbelievable, bro. Oh, another fumble. Okay, that's the most beautiful thing I've ever laid my eyes on. Thank the Lord I didn't go in yet and turn the fumble slider all the way up. Oh, my God. Let's go. That's huge. That might have just saved me 50 bucks. Sometimes being an idiot pays off. I might as well just get a little bit closer. The last thing I want to do is miss this field goal. They shouldn't be able to ice me, right? Because they don't have any more timeouts. What's the point in even calling timeouts if you're going to be iced? Regardless or not, you actually called one. I mean, the field goal is good, but I'm a little little agitated. At least it was the Giants to end up being so far the most hectic game of the video. The CPU fumble slider's on 50, so I guess we'll like bump this up to like, I don't know, 65 or something. Maxi works. I feel like in alphabetical order, there's a lot of bad teams in a row. We go from having to play with the Giants to the Jags. Oh no! 89 rated Rams, 75 rated Jags. This is gonna take a miracle. Do I even risk one quarter of sim with the Jags, dude? Once again, I might be down three possessions. Are they, they're going to shock me. They went right down the field. They're going to go down 14-0, nothing, dude. And yeah, I know we did break down, allow a quick touchdown, but at least we went out and gritted out a blocked extra point. Big play on second and 10. I'm going to allow the Jags themselves to see if they can score this touchdown. They're down to the 8, down to the 7, and that is going to be a two-possession lead for the Jags over the Rams. This is a 15 overall difference here. Am I trying to like, settle in for field goal range, or I just try to complete the pass down the field? That's exactly how we draw it up here in Jacksonville. Field goals good we regain that two possession lead that's huge dude never in a million years did i expect this half <sighs> drags fumble I, I swear to god you saw me do it you saw me do it but i really don't care bro i really don't care once again the hit stick god there's only two minutes left to go got the ball back i think we're good i think we're good okay they're they're scaring me they're scaring me again why does this always happen why does this actually okay a very anticlimactic ending there but another one down to the wire trevor lawrence and the jacksonville jaguars are super bowl champions a sight that me you and drew never thought that we'd see makes me feel all lovey-dovey inside now trevor lawrence whether it's with the jags or someone else is a guy that you know this 
isn't too out of the question, but will he be in a different jersey the day he actually gets it done? At least for now, he's happy. Bro, is this some sort of joke? Type of three team streak is that the Giants, Jags, and now you get to top it off with the Jets, bro, and it gets even worse. We're down by 10. That is not good at all. I think this is going to be the biggest deficit we've had of the video yet, so uh, we have some work to do. The god dang Jets, bro, they're always the bane of my existence. Don't worry, just a few PA crossers away. I mean, this slant would have been open, but we have bad men in our face. It's a fourth and 23. I feel like if I punt this, it's kind of like conceding defeat. Can this stupid freaking play save me one more time? This really could end up being our first loss if we don't get this. It, it, it's not looking good. That's really not how I drew that up. I, mean, I think it might already be too late anyway, but if we don't get this, dude, this is a GG. Of course, it just had to be the Jets. He's going to make this catch. Oh my God. There's just no way. There's just no way that just happened. A little spin move. Ooh. Going to the fourth quarter. Boys, we're at least going to go out trying. Oh no. Oh, underthrown. Oh, sometimes I just smile because life is so good to me. I've never wanted PA crossers to get open more ever in my life. Elijah Moore, touchdown. I do have a reason for going for this, and that's why. But now if they score a touchdown, I can like let them score and maybe still get a chance to get the ball back and tie it with a touchdown and two-point conversion. Strategics, why I went to Harvard. I feel like they're going to get a first down. Oh, no, please don't do it to me. Odell, I, I really think they're going to review this and he was in bounds. I really feel like he was in bounds. Okay, thank God we actually have a chance to win this. Nervous because I feel like with as many times I've caused fumbles, I haven't fumbled once. Now I feel like I'm kind of due and I feel like now that I've mentioned it, it's going to happen. It really is. Probably shouldn't have called a run here, but we'll run with it. No pun intended. That's why. That's why I did it. Michael, go. No, no, no. Why is this not ice? Not complaining, but like, here's the logic. Bill goes up. Obviously, it's good. Our greatest escape yet. Zach freaking Wilson's the one doing the hugging. A site that I would be willing to put a lot of freaking money on that I bet in our lifetime, or at least my lifetime, we'll never see. Zach Wilson and the Jets, Super Bowl champion. Yeah, you must know this is a Madden video. Let's just get this over with. What else is there to say, dude? It's the Lions. We gotta stop first drive of the game. Bro, Lions came out swinging. Please go up by two possessions going to the fourth quarter so it can be stress-free. I didn't really mean go down. Like, are we really going to scramble with Jared Goff? Jared Goff's got a little wiggle to him. We're actually going to pick up a decent little 20 yards and a Jared Goff scramble. Make this catch. Oh, my. We are 19 yards away from once again finding our way out of all this nonsense and all this trouble. We're running this because we're going to get all the way down to, like, the six-yard line. If I take a sack, we, we could kind of be screwed a little bit. Just be smart. Just throw the ball away. Throw the ball away. I'm scared. Like, bro, I don't know what to do. There's just so many things that could go wrong here. We have two plays to try and win this football game. Khalif Raymond. Get in bounds, you wonderful wizard. Khalif Raymond. I was so scared, bro. That could have gone so bad. I thought he was about to get pushed back and stopped right at the end zone. Right now, you are my hero. Oh my god, we just completed what will have to be. It's got to be the most difficult three-game stretch. Aaron Goff with the hug. There's no way you can watch this entire video and not come out of it happier. Number one, you get to see your favorite team win a Super Bowl. And number two, you get to witness 32 hugs. All positivity. That's more like it. A three Three overall difference and not a 10 overall disadvantage. MVP Aaron Rodgers, bro, please do your magic. Something gives me a bad feeling, though. Like, something tells me this is about to be the hardest game yet. Just at the end there at the quarter, bad things happened. I have faith, though, in Aaron Rodgers and his team. They're too talented to not score a touchdown on their own. What I tell you, I'm a wizard. Tight game could be worse. It's worse now. Made it not as worse. I mean, they're not as open as I'd like, bro, but <laughs> Aaron Rodgers, that was a laser, and it really had to be. My defense made a stop. Now, my offense, can you save me time? You're talented enough to do so. They're moving down the field. Did the sim? What just happened? Uh, that's not really how I drew up moving down the field. But at least we scored in a more normal fashion. Deservingly so. Aaron Rodgers wins his second Super Bowl. Is this the very final game that we'll see Aaron Rodgers play in a Green Bay Packer uniform? It just will look so weird if Aaron Rodgers ends up playing in a uniform that's not the Packer green. I'm really hoping the Panthers are one of those teams to go all the way all four quarters take it all the way on their own this could go either really good or really bad next quarter come on early start we get the early
early start. Our defense coming out. This might actually be the one. More than likely about to score a touchdown. They scored the touchdown, but we move. Everything's crumbling beneath our eyes. You know what? We'll go one more corner deep. I made the right decision. I think I was wrong. I would absolutely love right here for a fluky forced fumble. <laughs> DMC should be open. Oh, just give me a split second. Fourth and ten. Oh, no, dude. Can PA crossers... I, I thought there at the second the magic was going to resume, but boys were screwed. Oh god, guess and run up the middle. If they pick this up, it's a GG and I'm $50 poor. Up the middle. Oh, we're all over it. We're all over it. I'm gonna call a timeout. This is not what I signed up for. Why must she do this to me, dude? I gotta call a timeout. I think I, I think I just guessed from up the middle. I think I just guessed from up the middle and I should have kept it. Fumble. You gotta call. Just let them It's over. I just lost 50 bucks, bro. Who would have thought? The Carolina Panthers are the first team to make me spend money. At the end of one, though, we are up by three points. Just simulated the entire quarter as we're going to jump into quarter number two. We're, at least it's tied. Please, a huge drive. We're, we're settling for field goals. That time we had a touchdown. At least it looks like I don't have to go through a full other game of stress. You know what, though? Rightfully so, Panthers. Rightfully so. You do give me an easy attempt number two. Yes, Sam. You owe me. Hopefully the Patriots and Mac Jones will reward me for being a stan of his. Come on, Patriots, make it a successful quarter number one. It's not started off too good. It's honestly gone about as bad as it possibly can. Oh, that's my bad. That just is. That's what it was. Don't lose your composure, man. This was a bad idea. There's just no way. There's just no way on this earth that that just actually, like, happened in front of my eyes. The ball went through his shoulder, bounces, lands magnetically into his hands. If they just minimize the damage here, score some points, we'll be all right going into the second half. As long as we're not down by two possessions, which still could happen. They still have a minute to score now. Okay, wide open middle of the field. I underthrew it, but okay. It's a nice little 30-yard play. It came out empty every single play. But it works. It's Kendrick Bourne. That's a touchdown. Back within a one-score game. What do I do? What do I do? Probably throw it to the wide-open guy down the field. Kept his feet in bounds. I'll take it. Oh, my. Catch this. Hunter Henry touchdown. We might have left them a little bit too much clock. Not going to trust the CPU, though. Screw them. Don't disappoint me. Okay, thank you. Give JC Jackson his money. But although, be it with a new guy at the helm, Patriots winning a Super Bowl, not a sight we're unfamiliar to seeing. Matt Jones, I believe the guy has it in him. I feel like this could go either way. We have a good Derek Carr game. Maybe this could be a simple one. Come on, big quarter. We gave up a touchdown in like two seconds. At least we scored, though. Defense made the stop and gave the ball right back. Our offense, though, keeps answering. We're going to give ourselves one more quarter. And it was a smart decision up 21 to 17 the running backs wide open i'm pretty sure that was my man i'm pretty sure that's the second time that's happened in today's video just cool calm collected las vegas raider football tight end he has foster moreau that's a first down that's all we're trying to do slowly but surely hold on hold on we just don't have enough time von miller has three and a half sacks oh Darren waller Darren Waller dropped it. At least it's a punt, sort of. There's no way they have the balls to pass. There's just no way at all. I'm gonna start calling my timeouts after this play. I'm weird about that too. I'm weird about a lot of things in life, as you probably can tell. I, I that's just that's just where I need to get the ball, though. I just need to get it there. Okay, thank you for making that tackle. You're my favorite person. Our offensive line sucks. Oh no, this is the game. This is actually the game. That's absolutely ridiculous. Like, this is the worst offensive line I've ever seen. We need a miracle. We need an absolute freaking miracle. I probably not even get the ball away, to be honest. I just gotta throw it now. Oh, somebody, please become a hero. Become a channel icon. That's a hundred dollars. I've got to get away. Oh, you guys are probably loving it. Good start to this one. Just kidding. I am not a Raiders fan right now. I am not a Raiders fan at all, bro. Of all teams, the Raiders are the one giving me the most problems. At least last time I lost in the second game, they made it a breeze. Cross the middle. Please make the catch in, you do. Oh, dear and Waller, I beg you, catch this ball in stride. And that is going to be the lead right there. Thanks none to the simulation, dumb game. There's just no way that's a real attempt. That can't be a touchdown. It was a touchdown. I think he's going to be open. He's definitely open. And please keep your feet in bounds. Did you do it? Did you do it? You completed the assignment correctly. Brian Edwards, good fella. We got it. 
We got it. Let's go. What's the flag for? Oh my god, what's the flag for? What's the flipping flag for? Don't tell me that's defensive pass interference. It's defensive pass interference. I swear to god, this is stuff that come out of my nightmares. There's no way this dumb freaking game, there's just no way on this earth this dumb freaking game is going to cost me another 50 bucks. I, di I just, I'm not going to believe it. Don't you dare. Don't you dare. Make the tackle. You know what, you stupid team? Nah, don't deserve to see you celebrate. Dumb game. Made things way too freaking stressful. So now it's time to win the Super Bowl with the actual Super Bowl champion. And you know what? If I actually find a way to lose this game, it won't count as a $50 loss. It'll count as a $100 loss. The only thing, though, is that if it does follow like it did in real life, it's going to be stressful all the way to the end. And what do you know? A stressful first quarter. Oh my god, can it ever stop? This could actually be a touchdown. Down. If we can get that ball to Robert Woods, I feel like Matthew Stafford in real life. I feel like I did that. I feel like I made that audible. I did that all on my own. I made the throw. I'm the genius behind it. Oh my cup might actually be open, and he is by a pretty big margin. Cam Akers, can he get in? Oh my god, what a run as the young monster gives us the lead. I'm not gonna accept that as real. Thank you, Jalen Ramsey. I'd rather you just like batted that down. Did we go out? Did we go out? Now you did. Jesus, like it just can never be easy. You know what, Rams? Get out of here, dude. You already got yourself a real Super Bowl celebration. It's not fair to watch, too. I would like to give a massive shout out to Dr. Squatch for sponsoring today's video. As you guys see here, bar of soap in my hands in the packaging, but I'm telling you, this is, I've already given away my favorite freaking scent. This one's pine tar, but Dr. Squatch is so cool. They make these super cool little bars of soap for men from all natural ingredients. Like, I know it might sound weird, but like, I, I could just sit here and smell it. Like, it really smells so good. I opened up my package. It literally felt like I just opened up the package of nature. Like, it literally, like, all the smells of nature just hit me at once, and I loved every second of it. And when I say they have nothing but all natural ingredients in here, I mean it. You can smell it. Like, there's just no way it smells this good, and it's not completely natural. You might not know this, but a lot of the soap out there is jam-packed with ingredients that just aren't good for you. Just a ton of harmful chemicals, and why use that when you can get a bar of soap like Dr. Squatch? It smells a million times better and it's all natural and not harmful to your body. Like, it's a super easy decision in my book. And now, Dr. Squatch, with shampoo and conditioner, and on top of that, we have some deodorant, which smells amazing. This one is Birchwood Breeze, and it, it smells good. Makes my pits smell very good. And it's so cool because if you use Dr. Squatch soap, and you can honestly say it's not the best bar soap you've ever used, they'll send you your money back, no questions asked. Like, think about that. I know that sounds like they're setting the standard pretty high, but like you gotta smell the soap you gotta use this soap and you'll understand and new customers can now get 20 percent off orders 20 dollars and above if you click the link and use my discount code dsqrbt new customers can get 20 percent off orders 20 dollars and above by simply just clicking the link and using my promo code dsqrbt that is such a great offer for literally the best soap on the planet click the link Description box below, get your Dr. Squatch today, and it just like, if anything, just smell it. Like, it, it just smells so good, dude. Now, Baltimore, their team I trust to actually make this a little bit easier on me. Let's speak positivity. You know what? This first quarter is going to be an absolute breeze. Look at that. 7 nothing Defense going to come out. Only allow a field goal that gives me the faith to put us into another quarter. I trust the Ravens. I trust the Ravens. Please tell me I was smart for trusting the Ravens. It doesn't look like it at all. Well, boys, this isn't good. I'm just going to, I'm going to run the ball. Because that's what Lamar Jackson can do with that sub 4 three, 40 yard dash speed. I'll keep thinking and dunking, though. It's probably actually the best way to go about things. Oh, boys. It was so close. It was so close. Like, if I can't win in this challenge easily with the Ravens, how is a Madden player like me supposed to have hope? A team, even though not my favorite, don't mind displaying the rightfully earned Super Bowl celebration. Lamar Jackson, first hug we've seen in a few games. I think most neutral NFL. NFL fans will be happy the day they actually see this guy holding up that trophy. The New Orleans Saints, the NFL franchise actually closest to me. Sean Payton, I put my trust in you, although I guess this would be technically his last game as the Saints head coach. Give him a touchdown. Always not what you want to see, but I like to see a quick little response. We'll give the Saints team one more quarter. Oh, big play to Michael Thomas, who I guess is healthy. A big touchdown to Trey Quan Smith, Jameis Winston, the GOAT, and of course, Marcus Why? Oh, you're getting so close. 
close, Jameis. You're getting so close. One more play, bro. Didn't get it, did you? Didn't get it. We're gonna kick the field goal, though. Let's keep the pace up. Keep the pace up. Just smash the button. Smash the button. Keep on pressing it. I still believe. I still believe. It looks like, hopefully... How'd they get the- They really did. So much just happened in those last 45 seconds of my life. I think I'm just gonna throw the ball to Alvin Kamara almost every play unless he's covered like that. Jameis Winston, though, I'm telling you, bro. He's an underrated tank. Like, I don't care what your opinion is. I'm throwing this to Alvin Kamara every time I can. Like, he's kind of clamped. Okay, this guy isn't clamped. Who is that that snuck away? Adam Troutman, you little beast! You little monster! Like, it's just not possible to miss, like, a 10-yard field goal, is it? Like, how did they get a timeout in? What does that mean? Did I get, like, double iced or something? Watch me miss it now. Maybe Zach Taylor is a genius. Not quite. For the first time since the Drew Brees era, with a Super Bowl trophy coming back to New Orleans. I'm telling you, bros, by the end of this, my heart is not going to beat properly. A Jameis Winston post-Super Bowl MVP celebration interview would probably be the best thing the sports world has ever seen. We've got to make it happen. Russell, please, I beg. Oh my god, this is... I love to see. Poetry emotion, although they're probably about to score a touchdown. I love this start. Can we get the ball back one more time? No, we didn't. They're, they're gonna take the lead, though, aren't they? No, they're not. This is like trying to commentate a competitive Rubik's Cube competition. Oh, we're down by eight now. I, I probably should jump in the game, huh? DK, please. Oh, that's a kind of scary. Wasn't Rashad Penny a first-round pick? Like, why? Like, who made that decision? Maybe I need to rethink what I just said, because maybe Rashad Penny is a monster. Oh, what a play. This one is third and goal at the one. It was simple, kind of anticlimactic, honestly. I'll probably run the same one twice in a row. Like, honestly, bro, look how much space we have. I probably could score on this play. Like, that's the easiest two-point conversion I've ever attempted ever. Fourth and seven, they're gonna have to kick a field goal. Okay, I, I can live with that. No mistakes, bro. No mistakes at all. Gerald Ever, I need you to... Well, this play might cost 50 bucks. He's so open, bro. Just secure catch it. Gerald Everett, South Alabama, man. That's my boy. So make sure I watch the clock, but like, I, I don't want to give him the ball back with any time. Let's make sure I don't lose here. It kind of wasn't open, but I see a little gap. Oh, the block was beautiful. It was beautiful. But Seahawks fans, this is how it would have looked. It actually ran the ball with Marshawn Lynch. You'd be able to see Russell hold a trophy. Come on, Big Ben. You can't go out sad. Defense is actually coming up strong, which is our offense that sucks. But they heard me say that. They go up on top 24 to nothing at halftime. How did that happen? So that means we're going to click this button again and hopefully sit there and watch the Pittsburgh Steelers deliver me an actual easy dub for like the first time in the past like four hours dude the rams did not put up a fight at all in that second half and the steelers with one of the easiest wins of the entire video and i just accidentally skipped the celebration that's part of the whole point i'm the worst youtuber on this planet oh this is gonna be a rough one especially considering that i'm gonna have to use davis mills as quarterback all i ask is that you hold your own to like halftime you gotta leave it didn't last for long i'll give you one more quarter to get your stuff together and they got their stuff together they definitely got their stuff together they continue to get their stuff together what like what is going on i mean i expect the rams to somehow make it like tough right 13 point lead going into the fourth quarter Okay, like, you don't have to do this to me. Like, this always has got to happen. Like, it can just never end up being as easy as it seems like it will. It, like, gives you false hope, bro. Don't like false hope. Oh, my God. Huge play. Fourth down and 11. Maybe it's just me, but I don't suspect that that was the actual play call. We're going to come out of here with a very simple W. The Houston Texans end up actually being one of the easiest teams to beat the Rams. Davis Mills, you heard it here first, future Super Bowl champion. You get to see the virtual Super Bowl celebration hug right here from the King Mills. It will happen in real life just like it did in the virtual world. The moment I've been waiting for, my Tennessee Titans a chance to beat the Rams for the second time this season and actually claim our first ever Super Bowl trophy. And since this is my favorite team, you know what? I'm actually going to be faithful and trust in my team. I have so much confidence, I'm going to go ahead and simulate to the end of the game. We're going to come out of here with a big fat W. We're down 3 nothing, but that doesn't stop us to pour our hearts out on the football field. We take a 10-6 lead. Actually, we're down 13-10. Like, this is the most stressful thing. You guys don't even understand. It's a tight game. There's just so much going on, and I have so much emotion right now. We lost.
and that counts. I would have stopped it if I'd have realized what was going on there at the end, but that just happened so fast. I lose with my favorite team. That's $150 now I have to give away in the comment section below. I have faith though, there's no way we lose two games in a row to the Rams. There's no way. We're up six nuts. We need some of those field goals in the points because they're gonna do that. I think I just saw Ryan Tannehill throw an interception, which is definitely a likely scenario. Why is this such a low scoring game? We have the lead. We have a big lead. They cost me 50 bucks, but they at least did it on their own. I get to see my favorite team actually celebrate winning a Super Bowl because even me, I know this isn't gonna happen as long as Ryan Tannehill is the starting quarterback, but uh, we gotta watch him hug somebody here in a second anyway. At least we get to see Derek celebrate. Well deserved. Here's the hug. Ah. Matthew Stafford said he stinks. And it all comes down to this, the final game. One of the biggest videos here on the history of the channel all ends with the Minnesota Vikings King Kirk Cousins in today's video with the Super Bowl. Not giving away any more money, guys. Dang it, not gonna let it happen. Hopefully this will be the last freaking time I have to watch this stupid intro. Kirk Cousins, please, bro. You're a veteran. Make this easy on me. Quarter number one, just, just keep it close. Keep it close. I like it. It's a big first quarter. Defense playing big. Let's see if we can make it a halftime with a lead. No. Yes. No. At this point, why not just go one more quarter? Just please, just don't go. Uh, that, that's just not what we like to see. It always happens and they score quickly, but that's still down by a touchdown. That's not what we want. All right, boys, I guess we gotta hop in and do work one final time. I'm just bringing everybody. I don't care. They're either scoring a touchdown or making a stop. Well, I was sort of kidding. I think I've got to score before the two-minute warning, or we might already be screwed. We probably already are. I mean, what am I talking about? There's two minutes left. You can make this catch, though. Like, if we can do that play again, let's duplicate it. It's Justin Jefferson. He's got to make this catch. Of course he does. You know why? Because it's Justin. Oh, Justin, please, bro. You got a glowing X underneath your body. Of course you're going to keep your feet in bounds. Let's go. Part of me wants to be silly. If I get this and can get the ball back, I actually win with a touchdown. Like, why not when it's always the case? It always works. Don't even have to do an onside kick. You've just got to get three straight stops. We can't afford to give up a first down. Of course, a video of this nature was going to come down to this, or we can just end the video by scoring a touchdown and taking the lead. That's one way to go about ending things. That's pretty epic. I mean, I'd be lying if I didn't say I was pretty happy inside and a little big down low. Somehow we take the lead. Like, how did that just happen? We just scored two touchdowns in a span of, like, 10 seconds. This could prove to be a very, very costly mistake and it's gonna probably prove to be in my eyes it's a dub you might consider it a mickey mouse dub but not in my book and the game officially ended by dalvin cook and once we kneel this football a few more times which gladly done by the cpu we have completed the challenge as we have officially won the super bowl with all 32 nfl teams i lost three times 150 dollars given away to you guys in the comments i'll figure out later in what increments i want to give them away i might do 350s it'll probably be the best thing to do but one of the hardest challenges i would say i did it in the channel one of the most time consuming it was fun and what better way to end today's video by zooming in on kirk cousins holding a super bowl trophy kirk freaking cousins